I don't know. I'm just kind of blown away. I just looked up those comps and that's crazy. That's probably my best find ever. How's it going everybody? So in today's video, I find the most profitable item I've ever found at a garage sale. Super excited to share this one with you. So enjoy the video and let's get into it. All right, just left the garage sale and I picked up two things there. Uh, this one's for eBay for sure. This is a vintage Oakland Athletics hat, new old stock. And uh, this thing here might stay in the family. Not really sure, but it's a really nice uh, Swingster vintage Oakland, uh, Oakland Athletics jacket. So I paid 25 on the jacket, which it's probably worth more than that, obviously. But the hat for four bucks. That's going to be a good deal, too. This one's from 1998. The skeletons aren't super old, they're from 2007, so let's see what they want on these two things. How much are your Halloween well, things? I've been moving about more to the rifle. Okay. My dad's a that works. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Got to get rid of them. So we got a dollar, dollar total on this stuff. Probably say 25 cents, but let's give her another dollar. So I'm gonna get those two things, and then how about for this guy? Um, what did I say? 50 cents for for so those? Yeah. 150. I'll just do two. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. All right, so I'm the proud new owner of a Wii drum set and I actually got this for free. Well, technically free. I was just at a garage sale and the lady was struggling to put up her canopy thing. So this is before anything was out. So I helped her set up that. And it was kind of a pain, so that took me like 15 minutes. And then afterwards she asked me what I was looking for, and I said video game stuff like always. And she pulled this out and just gave it to me, so that was nice of her. I tried to offer some money, but something like this sells for like probably 50 plus shipping. Nothing crazy, but it's still pretty cool. So she wants $2 for the Fitbit and 40 for the ease. I couldn't find them when I looked them up, but they're Polo Ralph Lauren, made in Germany. Definitely look vintage. Are you pretty firm on the price on this? The glasses? The glasses, yes. Yeah. Oh, go. Okay. Yeah. I couldn't find it, but. You couldn't. No, uh, was that a sold comp or just listed? Listed. It was, oh, okay. And then they have them on uh, another Wentworth for 12 of them for 400 Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is it. Uh, um, you have to put in MCM Ralph 
uh, MCM Ralph Lauren. And then I yeah. Google lensed it too. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Ten dollars for that. Yeah. Oh, you're good. Here you go. I'll just get this for now, and I'll I'll think about the cups. Okay. I'll look around a little more. Thank okay, you. Okay. Thank you. All right. Just went into a state sale, and this is what I came out with. So I got this really nice Raiders hat. So this is a vintage Raiders hat, and it is uh, Team NFL. So Taiwan, not made in USA, but still a really nice hat. Uh, so we got that and then the vintage uh, wrapping paper, Big Bird Christmas wrapping paper for five bucks. So five for all that, not too bad of a deal for an estate sale. All right, just went into a sale and there's a lot of little kids running around so I didn't record, but I got this glove here for five bucks. It's a Rawlings Renegade. It's like a first baseman's glove. So five bucks, that should be a good deal. And I got this softball bat. This is a Easton Mako drop 10 and it's uh, like a travel wall bat but this will clean up easily with like some dry erase or uh, that magic erase marker stuff and it'll look real nice when I'm done with that and that should be pretty good that was three dollars so eight bucks there and we're gonna keep on going right. Whoa, it's this is an embroidery machine I've been looking for one they want 30 bucks for it, which is like nothing. So I'm gonna pick it up. It comes with all this stuff. Yeah, that's the deal. There you go. It does embroider. It does. So, yeah, yeah, so that's perfect. 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 It's um, heavy, but I'm sure yeah. you can. And I, this, I don't know how that, this goes on. The bottom. The, the cup, okay. It just yeah. slides in there, and it's like a. Yeah. My mom sews, so she'll probably be able oh, to. Perfect. Tell perfect. me all that. Perfect. So. All right, so I'm gonna load it up, and then I'll come back and check out your other stuff. Yeah. You Thank you. Uh, I should be good. It'll probably make two trips because it's pretty heavy. Yeah, it is. All right, thank you. Thank you. So I just got this sewing machine or embroidery machine loaded up into the car. And when I looked up this originally, I just looked it up on Google because I wanted an embroidery machine so I can do some more like custom stuff for like when I do giveaways and stuff, I can embroider a hat or a shirt or something like that. Uh, so that's why I looked it up. But then after I got in the car here, I did a little bit of research on the value of it just to see if it had any value. And this might surprise you guys. So this thing sells for like $3,000. So for 30 bucks, I mean, what is that? That's a hundred, hundred times profit. So I might actually sell this thing, get a little bit more simpler embroidery machine for like 600 bucks and then profit i don't know i'm just kind of blown away i just looked up those comps and that's crazy that's probably my best find ever if it works but yeah keep an eye out for i guess embroidery machines for 30 bucks because they're worth thousands crazy oh my god she was saying the shoes are between two and five dollars so found some hokas some real clean Nikes, like little slippers, little slippy slips, and then these. So, who knows? Even if they're five dollars each, that's okay. But we'll see. Oh, you found some? Yeah, I got a few pair. Nice, I got a bag for you, Fly. Okay. Um, how much is that 49ers sign? Daddy. The neon one. Is it still work? Mm -hmm. yeah. He just had oh, it. He wow. unplugged it from his garage. 
Okay, I'll grab it for three bucks. Okay, all right, That's... let me get your bag. You need a bag? Uh, help you or are you good? Yeah, maybe a bag for the shoes. We'll throw them in there. Thank you. Oh yeah, you're a diehard fan? You should have seen his room. Oh yeah, he had all the cool stuff. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. All right, Perfect. so shoes. I'll put the shoes in there. I left a pair on the ground over there. Oh, okay. okay. Uh -huh. I'll grab them real quick. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll $10 for all. Let 10 for all the shoes? Uh -huh. Okay. $10 Sounds good. All three pairs. $3 for the, $3 for the sign. Yeah. We'll just do uh, maybe 10 for the shoes. Uh -huh. And then I'll just give you five on the sign. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think three was a little too cheap. <laughs> Thank you, though. Thank you. Enjoyed that. Yeah, appreciate it. Picked up a couple more things there. Just these two games. Got Xbox One Tekken, brand new, sealed. And then that game. I don't know why I got that one. I don't know if it's worth anything, but they were a dollar a piece. Uh, so I got that, and then this sign is super cool for three bucks. I gave him five, but has a little stand. You don't even have to hang it up. That's super cool. They got crazy deals there. And I'm going to show you when I go back in because I got to grab something else. But uh, it's like tucked away. They said no one's coming because they can't find it. And you guys will see why here in a second. All right, this is the last garage sale for the day. So this is going to be like the final little deal. I might go do some other stuff, but look. This is how you get into the garage sale. Signs right there behind all the bushes. You gotta walk all the way back here. All right, don't know why, but I got spooked when those people came around the corner. But yeah, this is what I was going back to get. So I got six pairs of shorts for a dollar each. So I got vineyard vines, shorts, and they're all vineyard vines or Patagonia. So there's a set of Patagonia. Another Vineyard Vines. Little Patagonia. Little Patagonia. And Vineyard Vines. So for a dollar a piece. I think they're all pretty close to the same size. Either 28 or 30. So you could potentially lock those up and try to get a little more, more out of each cell. But yeah, that was, that was a good little place there. Uh, this one's for you, right? For sure. This is a vintage show. Might stay in the family. Not really sure about it. All right, so I'm the proud new owner of a Wii drum set. So she wants two dollars for the fifth. Head. This really nice Raiders hat. So this is a vintage grip. Uh, wrapping paper, Big Bird Christmas wrapping paper. I got this glove here for five bucks. It's a wrong. This is what I was going back to get. 